The stock boy appears to be less green than we'd hoped. I've heard his wolf killed a dozen men and as many horses. Is it true about Stannis and Renly? Both Baratheon brothers have taken up against us. Jaime captured, his army scattered. It's a catastrophe. Perhaps we should sue for peace. There's your peace. Joffrey saw to that when he decided to remove Ned Stark's head. You'll have an easier time drinking from that cup than you will bringing Rob Stark to the table now. He's winning, in case you hadn't noticed. I'm told we still have his sisters. The first order of business is ransoming Sir Jamie. No truces. We can't afford to look weak. We should march on them at once. First, we must return to Casterly Rock to raise They have my son! Get out, all of you. Not you. You were right about Eddard Stark. If he were alive, we could have used him to broker a peace with Winterfell and River Runner. Which would have given us more time to deal with Robert's brothers. But now, madness. Madness and stupidity. I always thought you were a stunted fool. Perhaps I was wrong. Half wrong? I'm new to strategy, but unless we want to be surrounded by three armies, it appears we can't stay here. No one will stay here. Sir Gregor will head out with 500 riders and set a riverland on fire from God's eye to the Red Fork. The rest of us will regroup at Harrenhal. You will go to King's Landing. And do what? Rule. You will serve as Hand of the King in my stead. You'll bring that boy King to heel and his mother too, if needs be. And if he gets so much as a whiff of treason from any of the rest, Baelish, Varys, Pycelle... Head spikes walls. Why not my uncle? Why not anyone? Why me? You're my son. Oh, one more thing. You will not take that whore to court. Do you understand? Thank you.